All right, guys, got this comment again on my last video. Christian conservatives worship power and control. They idolize their own self-righteousness. They are pride and hypocrisy itself. Trump is their new messiah. So first off, I call myself a Christian conservative because I am a Christian before I'm a conservative. Um, you say that we like power or we worship power and control. Look, all power and control belongs to Jesus Christ, my Lord and my Savior. I am in no position of power or control whatsoever. I don't go ahead and try to bully people into Christ. I tell them the good news about Jesus Christ, and they have to come to that decision on their own. They cannot go ahead, and I, I can't go ahead and tell people, hey, you have to serve Christ. There's other religions that do that, and I am totally against it because there are people that want power and control, but this Christian conservative don't want power and control i'm just trying to reach the loss for jesus christ and tell the truth and expose lies uh you say that we idolize our own self-righteousness i'm not righteous the bible says there's none righteous no not one there's only one righteous and that's jesus christ see i don't promote my self-righteousness i promote jesus's righteousness that he lives inside of me jesus came into my heart he saved me he made me new i am born again i am a believer of jesus christ he is my savior he is my lord I give him all the righteousness because he's the one that made me righteous. I cannot give myself self-righteousness. There are some people that look down on others. And my friend, if you have been looked down on Christians, I apologize on the behalf of Christians. But true Christians won't look down on people. They'll tell them about Jesus Christ. They'll tell them about their sin and they'll tell them a way out. That's how we're supposed to do it as Christians. Um, you say we are pride and hip we are hypocrites. There are some Christians that are very prideful. There are some Christians that are very uh, hypocritical. But I try not to do that. I try to go ahead and put my faith and trust in Jesus and him and him alone. If you get the point of this video so far, I put my faith in Jesus. Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. You got to come to the knowledge of Jesus. If you put your faith and trust in Jesus, you won't be prideful. You won't be hip you won't be a hypocrite because you're living in his life. And also, your last comment, Trump is their new Messiah. Uh, no, G Trump is not my Messiah. I don't put my faith in Trump. I don't put my faith in Harris. I don't put my faith in the UN. I don't put my faith in the United States government. I don't put my faith and trust in my pastor. I don't put my faith and trust in my church. I don't put my faith and trust in no other except Jesus Christ and him crucified. That's the issue right there. See, some Christians do that. Some Christians, oh, Trump will get into office. He's going to save the world. The video that you comment on with Harris and the evangelicals for Harris, these, these evangelicals are putting their faith in Harris that Harris is going to change America. I'm sorry. She will not. Trump, he will not. There's only one thing that's going to save America, and that is Jesus Christ and his precious blood. My friend, you're, you're saying that Trump is my new Messiah. He's not my Messiah. He's not my God. Yes, I prefer him over Harris. That is, that's fact. You can go look at any video I've done and say, you will see that I've said this multiple times that I'm a Trump supporter, but I do not put Trump ahead of Christ. And I condemn any Christians that do that. I condemn any Christians that put Harris in front of Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ is King of Kings and he's Lord of Lords. Daniel chapter two says that he sets up Kings and he brings them down. At the end of the day, God's will is going to be done, my friend. God's will will be done. I don't put my faith and trust in Trump. I don't put my faith and trust in Harris. I put my faith and trust in Jesus. So Trump is not my Messiah. And that, a lot of people might say it triggers me. Because you're trying to say I put a man before God and I don't. With that being said, whoever's watching this video of this reply, this comment, put your faith and trust in Jesus Christ and the finished work at the cross. He's the only way. He's the only truth. He's the only life. Some people might get triggered because I'm saying that, but guess what? That's the Bible, and I'm a biblical Christian. I live a biblical life. Try to, at least. I'm not perfect. I make mistakes. I sin. But guess what? Greater is he that is in me than he that is in the world. I love the Lord, and when I do, when I do sin, when I do make mistakes, he's faithful and just to forgive me, as Hebrews says. You have a good day.